Yeah, I reacted to this a long time ago, but I think uh this came through like early this morning for me. Uh this is uh I reacted to uh Zaya Wade transitioning over. But it was about something else a long time ago. But I'm reacting to Funky Diva talking about Zaya Wade transitioning. Well, as you know, a lot of people was uh, uh getting on Claudia and, uh Claudia about how she was talking about uh about uh Zaya and everything and she had made she had made some kind of comment and I never agreed to anything that Funky Diva used to say, but now that you talk about it, I agree with some of the things that Funky Diva say. I say this, if you straight and you ain't never been gay, best thing for you to do is stay your nose out of the trans business and let LGBTQ handle it. And that was the same thing he was talking about with allegedly Lil Mo. Lil Mo was talking about something too, about how the gay community or the trans community was bullying her, bullying the straight com uh, community. And that, uh, I guess basically bullying her, if you want to be real about it. But she was going to start an organization and uh, he was just saying he was just saying a whole lot. The little time that she got there, cause you know she, you know, you know, no, little mama ain't put out a a song in a pretty good minute. You know, he was just saying allegedly little mama need to go somewhere and sit down and put out some music and leave the gay community alone and leave the trans community alone. Let the trans community speak on what they need to speak on. With with they with the, the trans community because we can't speak on it for them and that and you know what y'all that's true I want to say that's true you know I used to could sit here and say that we could speak on a lot of stuff for the trans community but we can't because the trans community is the trans community that's just what they are they know what to say they know how to say it and they know what their feelings are and they know how they feel about things. You know what I'm saying? And I like the way Funky D will put it things. Funky D will put it to where he was saying, I'm sure Gabrielle Union and Dwayne Wade know what they're doing. That's their child. That's what's wrong with us. We need to pipe down, let these parents raise the day children the way they want to raise them. We can't tell them how to raise their children because we don't have any. And that's and and that's what I was saying. That's exactly what I was saying when I heard the incident about Dwayne Wade and uh, Gabrielle Union supporting Zaya. I, Zaya Wade. I think they should let people uh raise their kids however they want to uh raise their kids because I feel like they know. What's best for their kids, and I and and Funky Die Diva couldn't have put it any other way. And Funky Die and 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 and, and uh, I think he's right. I think he's right. When Funky Die Diva said, "Let go." Dwayne Wade and Gabrielle Union Wade handle that. They know what's best for Zion. But allegedly, Al was sitting there saying, I'm not gonna even gonna say allegedly, I'm gonna say Al was sitting there saying that he wasn't worried about what she was saying. He was worried about how was she feeling. And he said, No, Al, you can't say how she feeling because they got that. And I think that's why sometimes they don't too much like Funky Diva because Funky Diva came with some real stuff. Because Funky Diva said when he seen it, he got he got angry. You know, he got angry, and they and he was just like, people need to let people raise their kids how they want to raise, and that's true. You know, Funky Diva sit there and said, I'm pretty sure. 
if a person know when they straight at the age of uh, 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 three, four, or five, or when they in kindergarten, a person know when they're gay. And Zaya Wade came, and when she told, said Gabby, I'm a Gabby Union down, and said Dwayne Wade down, and told them, this is what it is. She knows what she's doing. They were saying that that Al was saying she wasn't say, he wasn't saying that she wasn't gay. He was saying she don't know what she's doing. And Funky Diva said, "Yeah, they know what they're doing. They got that. Let them worry about that child. That's their child. Who are we to tell them about their own child and how to tell them how to raise their child? And that's true. That's all I've been seeing." Because people like it's been a lot of uh, been a lot of people, uh, different people. I ain't gonna call no names, but been a lot of different little people, famous singers. I'm sorry, y'all. That was my uh tablet going off. It was a lot of famous singers going blasting off of the Wayne Wade, uh, because of what he's doing about uh Zaya Wade. So just because you don't like it, let the child parents handle it. I I, I totally agree. But I'm going to tell y'all something. I'm going to tell you something. People was black. When Lalaz came out, Lalaz X, I'm sorry, I'm talking so fast, y'all. Lalaz X came out. And he go to the BET Award and he dress up the way he dress up. They talk about him. Lil Boosie, I remember Lil Boosie was talking about him. And T.S. Madison had to get up there and, and, and say and say the big on the breakfast club. We need to learn to keep sometimes to keep our opinions to ourselves. Because we don't always have to tell our opinions. It's okay to have an opinion. And that's what Funky Diva was saying about the uh the topic that I was just talking about. It's okay to have an opinion. But we have no right to just say what Zaya Way or what 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 Zaya Way can or cannot handle because the Zaya Way is stronger and, and crazy and courageous and responsible more than you know. He was really, if I tell y'all, y'all go back and y'all see the story. It's on T T G I F. Y'all will see it. Where there's Claudia Jordan, Funky Diva, and Al Reynolds. I I never thought I I I mean I never really just actually heard Funky Funky Diva talk like that. You know, and they talk a lot of stuff about Funky Diva. They really do. But when Funky Diva said that about um. Zaya this morning and I and I listened to it and I watched it. I said that he couldn't have said it no better than I said it. He couldn't have he couldn't have said it no better than I said it. Because it was like he was almost up there. He was always he was almost upset. And I was saying he couldn't have said it no better than I said it. Because Ever since the transition started, that's all I've been seeing. And Claudia Jordan allegedly said that she's not saying that she don't support uh Zaya. That she was just talking about all the uh the ads or whatever. Girl, stop it. Everybody know what you were saying. You just got roasted and got popped and you didn't like it. That's what it was. 
So yeah, you and you and Al got roasted and got popped, and y'all tried to play it out by laughing and, and trying to move on to the next scene. Because I I give it up for Funky ID, y'all. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. He said what he said, and that's just what it is. Thank y'all.